I'm Roger Crawl, Product Manager at Paul Mueller Company. Let's take a look at installing a clip-on gasket on a Mueller heat exchanger plate. On most clip-on gaskets, the first gasket is made by cutting two gaskets in half and using the half with the rings. First, cut the gasket in half and discard the half with no rings. Next, remove every clip-on tab and the pieces between the rings and cross piece on the half to be installed on the flow side. Using a tube of glue, apply a small bead of glue to all sections of the gasket track. Applying a small bead of glue will prevent the glue from coming out from under the gasket after you've placed the gasket into the track. The glue is not for sealing, it's just intended to hold the gasket in place so they don't fall out as you load the plates into the unit. Place the gasket halves into the track evenly across the plate and set to the side. If any glue accidentally gets on the surface of the plate or gasket, it can easily be removed with a rag and alcohol. Stack a loose plate on top of the glued front plate and place some weights on top to hold in place until the glue dries. To attach the gasket on a flow plate, place the flat side of the gasket down. Start by clipping on the rings and the cross pieces, then complete by clipping on the sides. If you have any questions, call us at 1-800-MUELLER or email us at heattransfer at paulmuller.com.